I'll talk about Triple 7 and in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to add cool effects to Windows, just like the ones you're seeing right now. So these effects apply to basically any programs um, that you're minimizing and opening within the Windows system, including your start menu. Now, achieving this is pretty simple. Uh, it's using an application that I've been using for a while from Stardock called Window FX. It's a paid for program, costs about 10 American dollars. Um, if you choose to just buy the software itself, um, you can buy the suite for uh, $50. I used to have a cracked version of the software, but uh, I wanted the updates and I honestly really liked the software, so I decided to get the full version. Now, when you open the application, um, it's really simple to use. You have the animations tab, you choose on the left hand side where you're applying the animations to. You can choose random animations and it will just do random things for everything. Um, or you can go more in depth and change things like speed and choose individual um, animations for each application, etc. Clicking preview shows you a preview of what your animation looks like. Now, Window FX has more than just um, animations. It does some other, other cool things as well. So for example, here, uh, I'll show you guys, it can darken things that are not in focus. Now it doesn't apply to the actual WinFX application, but it applies to everything else. So for example here, Chrome is in focus, so the rest of the desktop is kind of darkened to bring emphasis to the Chrome window. You also have uh, the option for um, transparency, so it's the same thing as well. The active window is completely full and the other windows are transparent. Now WinFX also has some awesome productivity options. So for example, on Windows, if you drag your window to the top left hand side, whatever it is, it gives you the option to either put a half screen, the quarter, or the full screen. If you want some more options, you can do things in WinFX like making the top left corner go 33% or 66% or different percentage points, allowing you to customize how big a window goes. So you can, you, know, you can split into thirds and have each window go 33% if you need to see more than just two screen two windows. And there are, now there are some other options in Windows FX, um, but they're pretty small. And since I'm actually running like a beta version since Windows 10 support was just added, they're a little buggy. And honestly, Windows 10 features kind of cover them anyway. So that is pretty much it for this video, guys. Windows FX is available, like I said, for 10 bucks. I'll have a link in the description below if you're interested in checking it out. Um, it is available for Windows 7 and up. I may Vista, but for sure 7 and up, so 7, 8, and 10. And uh, otherwise, guys, that is it. So uh, thanks for watching. My next video is going to be on uh, my keyboard again, actually. I'm, I uh, have a new key pack, key pack kit coming in. So I'll be doing a video of the installation of that and show you guys a little bit about that. Otherwise, well, guys, that is essentially it for this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, leave a like. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave us below as well. Otherwise, happy hacking, and thanks for watching. This is the Hacker 0 7 and I'm signing off.